an actor, Buffy has worked with superstar Wesley Snipes in many of his films. His music has also been featured in a lot of television and other movies. And we are so honored to have Boppy with us today. Welcome, Boppy. Well, thank you for having me. I'm so honored to be here too, <laughs> you know. <laughs> so you're doing a scene, right? Yeah. And Wazy is going to, I don't know, change his shirt. Not so much so. They would probably cut it and then they send him to do another shot and then they'll put me in and fill in the shot. And so on. most time it's it's maybe a, a, a just the hand uh -huh. or the shoulder, you know, <laughs> or a, from a long distance away, you know, because I have his features and when I'm in the wardrobe that he's in also, it's the same. Right. You know, okay. sometimes maybe there's a bed scene or maybe, you know, and he, he doesn't do it like, for instance, one movie, uh, Seven Seconds, and I was the one who did the... The <laughs> yeah. How many other movies have you doubled in as a body double for him? Well, pretty much. Um, I've I've signed on with him per, as his uh, permanent standing in from Blade One. Oh, oh really? really? Yes. She don't like Blade. I like the Blade. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> but but, for, but tell tell um, Jamaicans, how did you get to that point? Yeah, how you, you go from yeah, Port yeah. Antonio to right. California? Yeah. Yes. Well. Make it quick, I go to Boom Portland, go to Kingston, then go to school. My brother said, graduate the high school and I get a job on the cruise ship. Hit the cruise ship, got the job on the cruise ship. Then the cruise director said, you want to be in the movie, go to California. Oh, I got connected with West. It was after on Blade One. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, one day in the trailer, they were cooking, the same day cooking Jamaican food for his lunch. So I decided, so, well, I'm going to go check, see if it, how it is. So I went in and checked, I said, hey, Right, you know, I'm saying, well, what you know, I, I could do something for you too, you know. And then the next day, now he said, Yo, man, you gotta cook me up some Jamaican stuff and so on. And I said to him, Say, well, yo, man, um, the, you got a personal guy, man, who stands in for you? And he's like, No, man. I said, Because. I'd love to do it, man. He said, "That's you your mean, chance. You really want to do it?" So that's yeah. why I go you just yeah. to him some book. Yeah, and he said, Seize "He said, it. he said, yeah. it's done. Talk to my assistant. I'll have another movie after this." Excellent. And the next movie was U.S. Marshal. And what did you cook that day? I cooked him some rice, some peas, and some brown stew chicken. <laughs> oh, nice. I'm into the blade thing, right? So yeah. I've seen all three blade movies. So you started with him from Blade One. Well, no, I start. Work with him the first time I, I met him on Rising Sun. I was doing extra work. With Sean Connery? Yes. Wow. And, and I met him on Rising Sun cause, because I sing and I had a band that <laughs> I just formed in Los Angeles and I wanted to bring people to come see my band, you know? And I heard Wesley love Jamaican people and Caribbean stuff, right. so I made it a point to meet him That's and right. to see what he's all about. Eventually, we kicked it off real good, you know. We start talking, he's talking about, yeah, you cook the rice and peas and all that. So he said, yeah, man, I bubble all the time too, man. He said, yeah, man, I love Jamaica, you know. He said, I went to Port, he'd been here before, you yeah, know. No, yes, and he, he said, he went to Port Antonio too, and he loved Bonneville Hill. And then after I um, doubled on the um, Demolition Man. I like that one. You know, they figured uh, someone who had worked with him, who knew him, they wanted to audition for that part. So I was the one who was his build, so they got me on Demolition Man to Dublin. I thought I was gonna stand in, you know. Yeah. I was all happy, you know, I'm saying, yeah, yeah, I was standing for Wesley, you know, <laughs> finally, you know. And uh, But they said, no, I'm gonna be on the second unit, you know. So I said, okay, okay. no problem. But That's I worked every day. So, so is there a scene when I watch back the movie now that I must look up for and say, that is Yo, see your with it? buddy. I'm actually in one and two. So which? Acting. Really? You can see me. You're acting in one and two? Yeah. Hey. I'm, I'm, I'm in, You're a vampire? I'm, no. So, <laughs> so it's, it's, not that, it's not that you can say, see Bopi hand here, yeah. see Bopi shoulder, you have to see your face. Bopi, yes. <laughs> Body boot number three. Enjoy, man. Uh, are you sure that the girls are alive? Last time I checked. See Bopi's there. Um. No man on your mouth. Watch it. You know when Supercat did that track, I said, Oh, you know me. What is he doing of late now? I He's mean, doing... With his misfortunes and all of that recently, what's, what's happening with him now in his life right now? He's doing quite well. He's, he's taking it 
as it goes, you know, it's like I did that single song called Take It Easy. He's taking it easy. I speak to him all the time on through email, you know, mm-hmm. and we keep, I keep in touch. He said he has lost many friends and he has understand a lot of things more now that, you know, you get the yeah, time. Man, they like you when you're up there. Yeah, not yeah. so much friends yeah. at times. That's when you find out who your friends are. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, so, yeah. you know, but he, say, he told me to say, well, to tell everybody. And he tell, to tell Jamaica much respect. He love everybody. And, and I don't know, he always love Jamaica, you know, no matter what. Mm. And he said, make sure you make them know, say, I love them and leave the box. Well, well, you make sure you give me my personal little message. We won't tell the rest of Jamaica. Right. Right. <laughs> so tell me about your soundtracks now. Don't go there. <laughs> Tell me about your soundtracks and, and the, what you've done for other movies and so on. We're in the family where uh, uh, John Lugaziama coming out the shower, when Wes was coming out the shower and he was trying to get a bad sign for this uh, uh, mm-hmm. uh, kid. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. My song was the song playing on the Excellent. radio. Excellent. What well, we got? Yeah, Sporting wants you to sign their balls. Before that, we got that Wish Upon a Star routine. Sick kid in hospital wants to shake hands with great ball players. Then if you just watch Crimson Tide, you'll see the movie when Denzel Washington walk up to the move to the gate to go on board the submarine mm-hmm. and a soldier walk out mm-hmm. to check his pass. That was me. I was supposed to say, okay, carry on, soldier. But instead I said, all right, go on, man. <laughs> <laughs> everybody bust up laughing. And they said, no, it's an American know. movie. If yeah, it was no, they would do it. If yeah, they don't have it, right? If they yeah. don't look yeah. up, yeah. I was done. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you prefer, music or the acting? You know, um... I prefer music. Why? Because I create and write my own lyrics, and any creator will create their own stuff. Would love to see someone love it and enjoy it, and something I do for people to entertain them. Mm-hmm.